not. Now, back in the day, back in 1916, when this cable was built, they weren't turning around 120 ton locomotives. The smallest steam locomotive, like they have been running at that time, that we actually have here, fully loaded with coal and water, weighs about 175 tons. So, combined weight, that would be about 250 tons. They can turn that 250 tons with only four people. Then we get on each end and there would be big poles sticking out of each end of the turntable and they would put all of their muscle into it to heave the turntable and load them running around. The way they do that, there's a six foot diameter bearing right here that the engineer is going to balance over. The way he knows he's balanced, he's watching right here at the far end of the table. And when he sees this table, the end of the table drop, you'll see it's elevated. When it drops, that means it's balanced. Now the engine's balanced, and today we're going to use a 25 horsepower motor that's located right there underneath the shack where our conductor is sitting there operating the table. Everybody make sure you wave at our engineer. Show him some appreciation for the good job he's done today. Your engineer's name is Kyle. Now when we get the locomotive and the turntable off, or the locomotive off of the turntable on track two, if you guys want to meet me down there at the crossing at the end of the passenger cars, we'll walk across and we'll go over to the shop and I'll show you a little bit about the restoration projects we have going on and a couple repair projects. And I'll talk about how we maintain and restore our equipment. <laughs>